Good morning, Tom Wiley here, and uh, this morning is a good reminder of God's faithfulness to keep us safe and his protection over us even when we're stressed and aren't quite thinking about uh, safety as much as we should should be. Um, last night, yesterday, was a, a, a good day of preparing our, house, our stuff to move. A friend came over and helped me get a lot of work done outside and get uh, a lot of things uh, ready to move uh, once we get to move. We also found out uh, yesterday we were supposed to close on our new property in Idaho. Uh, uh, there's a re there's a, an issue with um, they're they're reissuing the plat map for the property, and um, they're making a change that's good. We we like the change that's happening. It's just been taking a long time and been delayed, and we've had mixed messages on when it will be done. Um, the end of the day yesterday, um, after five o'clock, which was the, the timeout period for our, our contract thus far, um, we finally heard back um, and they sent us an addendum to extend, but it was a big, um, a big time of praying and brainstorming and thinking and evaluating uh, whether we wanna stay in or not because it's been de so delayed and, and everything. So that's another story, but, um, but anyway, yesterday was very full, last night was very stressful, and and then we came up here to my folks' place where we're where we're um, living in the RV for this next roughly month, and um, we came out to put the girls to bed. And I walked back past the pickup and saw see the two by fours the way they're they're in the bed of the truck and on the rack up there. This is how I found them last night. I had put those two by fours up on the rack, so they were touching that that front bar across and the rear bar they were laying on those bars uh, in our moving stuff around yesterday I had put them up there um, tucked against the corner the corner rail or posts um, I put them up there for a place to keep them while we filled the bed with other stuff temporarily just to move to another part of the property and and as I put them up there I thought you know I'm gonna forget these unless I either strap them down now or I'm gonna forget them and drive away with them unsecured unless I secure them now or unless I do something to remind myself and that moment that moment was key I should have um, stopped and went wait either I need to move these to a different spot or I need to go ahead and just throw a quick bungee on them so that they're good um, but I forgot and thought oh sure you know I'll remember <laughs> so moved forward and and uh, yeah sure enough I drove all the way up here across town up a steep hill um, and, and this is the way I found them. The two of them thankfully dropped into the bed, but one of them was just sitting here, hanging out, ready to, to either fly off into somebody's windshield or rocket forward if I had to stop suddenly. Um, close. It could have been really serious and, and, uh, had major consequences had things gone differently. So I'm praising God for his protection and and for this reminder that when we're going through stressful times, number one, remember the basics. Don't skip over simple thing like wearing your seatbelt or strapping down a load um, or drinking enough water or eating lunch. Just keep keep to the basics. That's what keeps us alive. And that's how we keep other people alive around us. Don't ignore stuff like that, even when you're stressed. And number two, trust God to keep you safe and, and to cover the things that you miss. Um, and praise him uh, for the things that you find out about along those lines. I hope you pray you have a blessed day, and I'll catch you later. One more thing. You want to know the first thing I did after making that video? I bungeed down those 2x4s so I don't forget again. Stay safe out there. I'll catch you later.